Honorable San Diego seniors want to stay home as much as possible, but at the same time, there are essential needs that force them to get out. Our ABC 10 News anchor Lindsay Pena spoke with a doctor about how to balance the risks of contracting COVID-19. Luther Tower in downtown San Diego is home to hundreds of seniors. Carol Clark is one of them and spoke to 10 News via FaceTime from her apartment. People are staying in. Everyone knows we're the vulnerable population. As far as she knows, no one in her building has gotten COVID. She says management has strict rules in place to encourage distancing, and everyone she knows is taking this very seriously. I'm amazed uh, that everyone here is doing so well, and uh, I think, uh, you know, kudos to management uh, for doing a good job. Clark and the others in her building are examples of the many seniors living on their own, still trying to go about life during this pandemic. And even though businesses all over San Diego are reopening, seniors are still being told to avoid going out. The current recommendations are still to really ask themselves as a senior, is this something essential or is it something that I can ask someone else to help me with? Dr. Rebecca Smith with Sharp Healthcare says she advises her patients to embrace technology whenever possible, use delivery services, and if you don't have family or friends nearby, there are resources like San Diego County Aging and Independent Services. Seniors can reach out to and they offer many services that can help them um, accomplish what they need to get done, but stay safe. Clark says she tries to keep her errands to a minimum and do it all one day a week. I try to incorporate as much as I can into the day that I'm out. That way I'm, I'm out, uh, you know, a lot less. She says it can be scary not knowing when this will end. In the meantime, she wants everyone to take the recommended precautions. If not for yourself, then for someone you love. You don't want to give it to your grandparents. Lindsay Pena, ABC 10 News. And today, the County Health Department said the official recommendations for seniors remain the same. They are urged to avoid close contact with others as much as possible to prevent the exposure of COVID.